Welcome to an overview of the Scopus Continuous Deployment System. In the next 90 seconds, I'm going to show you the fastest way to get your code into production. This is Scopus' main user interface. Although you can use the CLI or the API as well, the GUI gives the best demonstration. The main body of the UI shows the model for the application we're running, including the containers that make up our application, plus the relationships between them. Viewing the model this way is intuitive, but it's actually stored as a YAML file so you can check it in with your code and even edit it if you choose. Now that we've taken a look at our model, let's have Scopus check for updates for us. In auto-detect mode, Scopus will check for updates and let us know what's available to deploy. In auto-deploy mode, it'll actually do the deploys for us automatically. Now that Scopus is set up, let's take a look at our application. At the bottom of the screen, you can see it's running. So let's take a look at the UI. I'm actually running a private copy of one of DataGrid's SaaS services, but as you can see, I chose a terrible yellow background. So let's go ahead and change that. I've got a shell session open in PuTTY, so first I'm just going to check out a modified source file. And then I'm going to build a new container. Now we can go back and check the Scopus interface and we'll see that it's telling us there's a deploy ready to start. So what exactly will Scopus do when we hit start? Let's switch to the plan view and look at what's going to happen. We're only updating the HTML containers this time, so the plan was pretty simple up top. But if we step inside, we can see that there's actually a lot of detail, including quality checks, performance checks, and rollback plans. So let's start our update. And as we do, you'll note that you can actually watch Scopus progress. Now that our app's been updated, let's check the results. If I force a quick refresh, you'll see the awful yellow is gone. That's a very quick overview of Scopus. If it looks like something you're interested in, please contact us. We'll arrange a full demo or even sign you up for our beta. Thanks for watching.